This is Sims, and we are back with more of The Sims 4 House Rules, which is our Harry Potter Lovely. Legacy Challenge. And Gilderoy's still freaking out about the fire. Um, I ended the last part, and I was like, what the hell is he doing? He picks up the toddler and runs out of that. The fire is out, Gilderoy. It's been like a week. <laughs> Um, but anyway, we have lovely little Regulus over here. He is fucking precious. He is like, like, look, he's got little freckles and everything. And I don't know where he got the blue eyes from. Because he's got green eyes. And did, I don't know if, uh, I don't know if Caleb has blue eyes, but I also don't think Caleb's skin is quite this dark. But like, what up? He is what he is. But, uh. Yeah, I actually kind of like this hair because it's got the brown, which, like, Caleb's hair has. But then it's also, like, a little bit lighter at the tips, like his hair. So, I don't know. It worked. Anyway, okay, could you stop freaking out? The fire is out. I'm going to need you to go eat something and then go to bed. Um, But anyway, yes. And then we will worry about we should probably, at the end of this part... Be able to, t not Max, Neville, be able to take little Neville. Um, and yes, I saw the comment about um, making uh, Elora the untamed spellcaster. I don't have that Team X mod. So, yeah, and I didn't get it. I saw it before this part, obviously, but I was like, I don't know if I really feel like downloading the mod just to do that. Um... I'm really kind of annoyed that we can't buy a lottery ticket. I swear we did, but it's not checking it off. And it's still not... I mean, it's really weird that he can't... Um, more choices. Oh, we're having a baby. Web. Yeah, I can't even purchase a lottery ticket. You really need to meet me. Um, Morgan, please don't. Where the hell? It's like weird that I don't. Anyway, who's calling you? I don't know. Well, we missed that. Um, You also need to go pee so that you don't. Look at him. He's, like, sitting in the bush. <laughs> I wish I could have gotten a screenshot of that, like, sitting in the bush. Like, I really need to be. She can't purchase a lottery ticket, but I don't even have the option. Like, anywhere. You know what I never noticed? Is that, like, from a mod? Split from household and move? Wow. Why are you getting flirty with your dad? And I mean, I just do not understand why they still sit on plants. I don't get it. It works in this household because everybody's fucking magical, but I'm just really not 100% sure, like, what the actual fuck is happening here. Um, also, I'm sorry, who are you? You look suspicious as fuck. Don't they? Look at them. Rigoberto? I don't know. But anyway, where are you going? You need to pee, too. Go pee. You are going to go eat it still. Okay, and then you're going to have your baby. I don't understand why I can't. You're going to end up having a shitty holiday because I can't figure out how to... I mean, I know I purchased lottery tickets, but he's going to have a shit holiday because... Household... More choices. Order. I mean, where would you even... Blog about feelings. There's no... There's not even purchase lottery tickets on the... Via the computer or phone. I don't have the option. Probably because we already bought lottery tickets, but it's not marking it off, so it's going to be like, oh, shit holiday. Even though we bought lottery tickets, but I don't understand. The game has been doing this a lot lately. There's, I gotta have a mod that's fucking shit up. I don't know. But I don't think I've added any new mods. Oh, he's about to pass out any. Oh, no, he's just gonna... What the actual fuck? That is... That's a whole level of new. 
This is... It's because there's a plant in the... I don't understand my life. Oh. Whose project is this? Oh, okay. It's got to be Myrtle's then, I guess. Okay, well, here we go. Here comes little Galileo. Ah, uh, yeah. All right, well... Oh! Wait! What? Wait, what? Why? No, you have... One. What? Why? Can you go here? Oh, you're stuck. That's why. Uh, reset. Okay, um, have baby. Why do we have two bassinets? Uh... I... I checked before, and you were only having one. Okay. Okay, you, you were only gonna have one baby, but you... Because he got stuck. So this is probably going to like... I don't... Um, also, we have... Do we have a bassinet? I don't know if we did have one up here still. Because we reset the house. No, we got rid of it. So I don't think we had one down here either, did we? No, we weren't prepared for the baby. Alright, well... Um, I mean, I guess we're just going to leave him here because I don't really think our toddler slash child really wants this fucking baby in its room. He's like, I'm going to bed. Good grandpa will take care of the baby. You could, could you change diaper, bottle feed, rock, send to home world. <laughs> no, make a silly face, cuddle. Um, but here's the fun part. All right, so Myrtle, yeah, okay. So Myrtle and Galileo have the same, well, mother. Hmm. And then, okay. And Max should be aging up then. When does... Okay, he's gonna... Okay, so Max should be a toddler by the end of this part too. Because he was a baby. Yeah, but I can't buy a lottery ticket. I don't know where it is. But it's not here and everyone's gonna have a miserable holiday... Despite the fact that I actually did buy lottery tickets. So it's kind of annoying. It, look, everyone's going to be like, the lottery was awful. But I bought lottery tickets. I bought them, though. Oh, my God. That's so annoying. All right. Everyone's sleeping except for you. How are you doing? You need social. So why don't you go talk to the baby? Or go browse. Just flirt online. Okay, we could do that. Let's see who's more choices. Socialize. Let's go in the sim to chat room. Do we know anyone in here? Who could we? We don't know if any of these people are like. I don't. Okay. I think we're just going to chat. <laughs> More choices. Socialize. Check for pen pal replies. Regulus is hungry. Oh, that's this one. Uh, you can go get food. There's plenty of food sitting out. You're you've got legs. Okay. And he's gonna just come sit on a pile of books. Okay. I've got a pen pal in Isla Paradiso. Oh, and now he's just... Okay, he's sitting on the floor. I thought he was fucking hovering, and I was like, Jesus. Morgan! Okay, you need to go to bed. But which bed was yours? Did we give you the one downstairs? Okay, we gave you Alora's bed. Anyway, um... So, yeah, I, I don't have the mod. So I'm not concerned about it right now. Story purposes, Alora is the sage of Untamed. Um... But I will. Eating dirt is really unhealthy. Okay, great. I'm going to have you. Okay. 
Because this should be her bed. She wasn't sleeping in that one, right? That's your bed. We don't need to claim this. That's you. Okay. Anyway. Um, there's going to be too many fucking kids in this house soon. But anyway, what was I looking at? Baby's going to age up. Then everyone else ages up Friday. He ages up Saturday. Okay. Gilder has got to find some other, like, baby daddies or some shit. He's going to get abducted again anyway. We only need two more kids. Um, but I don't know. Should we have him go out there and find some sexy sims on the sim to chat room or should we just have more ki can you hug lovingly and then brighten day and let's clean this up um you are gonna go to school soon how's the toddler doing toddlers find morgan you need to go eat something, and then you really need to go the fuck to sleep. Like, I guess he's being a good gramps. He's not even an elder yet. <laughs> he's being a good grandpa, because he's like, everyone else is sleeping, and the toddler's just running around, and somebody's got to watch him. But like, oh, sweetie, no, nobody has to watch him. He's fucking fine. Although, okay, well, here's the thing. He better be a vampire child. Okay, he's a vampire child. Our other kids are aliens. We really got to find you spellcasters. How are we going to find other spellcasters? Like, there's not going to be a way to figure out who's a spellcaster. You know what I mean? So, like, how are we going to figure that shit out? So that we can have other spellcaster children. Um. Well, I guess if he has kids with other people, we can make... They would be spellcasters, probably. Chances are. Because he's got... He might have a weak bloodline. Um, but I thought she had a strong bloodline. Even though she's an alien. Or is she a spellcaster? I thought she was an alien. Which I says, oh, she might be a spellcaster. Interesting. Oh, she's... New sibling! She's happy about her new sibling! You, I don't think, have met your new sibling. You should come over here and look at the baby. Like, oh, what the fuck is this? What's that? There you go. What the fuck is that? Now, you are... Oh, God. Oh, oh you're going to grab a serving. Okay. Baby fever. It's time to add a new member to the family. Didn't you just pop out a baby? Didn't you literally just pop out a fucking child and you want another one? Are you getting a little thick around the middle there, buddy? What the? I think you are. You didn't get your post-baby body back, but you have your post-baby booty back, but you just got a little bit of a pudge. Got a little bit of a pudge there from having two kids. What the hell? That usually happens to the lady folk. We're going to have to do something about that. We're going to get you on a treadmill. You're going to have to go for a jog. You got to... Like, come on. You gotta keep that sexy body if you're gonna, like, eat ham. If you're gonna, like... It, he was like, I wanted a burger. Well, someone's gotta eat that ham, so you eat it. And why don't you... Uh, go brighten his day. Go chat with your child. Oh my god, we need a butler. <laughs> it's too bad that you can't take a butler that shows up and replace them with a sim that you created without you can go in and change the look of the person like we have a butler we could go in and change that butler but I'd have to start from scratch as opposed to I can't just take them and be like I'm going to delete them and then replace them with the sim that I made because I don't think that that's going to work because we have Pendleton and we have Sebastian in my fucking gallery. And that'd be fucking hilarious. And then we can knock up our sexy butler. <laughs> but like... Okay, so you're going to have to come over here. Rock, send a homeworld note. Make a silly face. Cuddle. And then change diaper, because by that point he will need a diaper change. I'm going to say that Max... No, really? How is he still a 
baby. He was born in the last episode. He's got to age up before this one. Um, we might go in and age him up. Who's calling you? We're having a seasonal party. Are you coming? No. Are you fucking kidding me? Grandma won? I... We played the lottery! That makes me so mad, though. Because, like, it just deleted. Oh, did we buy our potion house? We did. Yeah, you need to go pee. Okay, just go pee. Oh, go pee. Go pee. Go pee before you pee yourself. Okay, go pee. Go pee! Go pee! Go pee! Go pee! Jesus. Um, we could leave Grandpa here, and we could go run our potion shop for a little bit. Um, we don't have a lot in our inventory, but we could go there. Let's go travel to the potion house. Um, just for a few minutes. You know, it's not that important. It's just the fact that we own it, and it's cute. Um, and we can get the fuck away from the children. <laughs> Let's just get away from the kids. They're driving me crazy. Um, we're going to have a lot of... Uh, we'll have two baby makeovers. A minimum. For house rules. To Yay! Lots of makeovers this week. So, like, next week we have lots of makeovers. Because um, Neville and Galileo will both be toddlers. Oh, my God. We're going to have three fucking toddlers in the house. This is not a good idea. Well... Thank God we got Morgan, and thank God we have the potion house. We can just be like, peace out, bitches. Um, and so maybe we shouldn't worry about getting anybody else pregnant. But let us come in here. And let's go in our inventory and see what potions we have. Pause. Let's see. We've got magical aura. We can stick this here. We can stick the nausea potion here. And we should be able to set for sale. But does it tell you how much... If we set for sale, does it tell you how much this is? You know what I mean? I don't know. I mean, they should have... Well, yeah, because we can sell that for $200. So we should be able to sell them. Uh, and then what, 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 what's that one? Curse cleansing. We should keep that because we might need it. Forced friendship. We can, uh, set for sale. What's this one? Alluring aura. We should actually keep that one, but we can, um, we can make another one. Plentiful needs. We can definitely sell some of these. Let's actually put this one over here. We'll sell a lot of these. Um, we should hire someone to come work for us, but, uh, set for sale. Then what do we have? Which ones are these questionable contents? Uh, set for sale, set for sale. We got a lot of these. So hold on. What are these? Good fortune. Oh, we can sell lots of these. Okay. We'll keep the rest of them. Uh, do, 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 do. We're just setting. I, we got to set up. I just, this is the reason why we're not like. Okay, hold on. I can just let it play and then maybe we can like open the store while people are coming in and then we can just uh, open. Yay! Customers are on their way. What else do we have that we can sell? What's this? Masterful insults. We'll, uh, did we set these for sale? Yeah, we did. Um, rejuvenation, we can put one of these out. We'll put two of these out. We'll save some of them because we might... I don't know. When, no, 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 no. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't put away books. Stop that. Set for sale. Set for sale. What else do we have in here? What's That's good fortune. What was this one? Nimble mind. We can... Put a couple of those out. Um, and then what else did we have? We already put the rejuvenation ones out. Hold on. What's this? Perk purging. We don't want to purge our perks, so we'll put these out. 
And set for sale. Set for sale. Set for sale. We have a lot of room to put more thingies, but uh, but there we go. Let's see if anyone's going to show up. Oh, look, there's someone showing up. Look, and he's just sitting at his desk. It's perfect. I love it. It's amazing. What's this one? Curse cleansing. We'll keep that because he's he he might, you know. Let's uh, discuss shopping preferences. It's almost Morgan's birthday. It's almost Galileo's birthday. I feel like Neville will have been aged up. Let's greet customer. Bright and day. Uh, he's going to go greet her, and then we'll come over here and greet. I mean, for the most part, we'll just let them, like, browse around, and and hopefully this works. Because, I mean, they are worth something. Prompt resurrection, in case we need that. Um, you don't look like a spellcaster, but we'll greet you anyway. Yell at. More choices. Retail. Discuss shopping preferences. Um, this is what's a pain in the end. Oh, this girl is like almost ready to buy. Wow, there's a lot of people in here and I can't click on the girl that's... Uh, more choices. Retail. Answer questions. Holy shit. Mm. Hopefully... Although, hold on. Let's see something. What's our... We can't do that while well, the store's closed. Okay, I just don't know what they are, but... Greet customer. Everyone's going to just kind of purchase on their own. I like that. Look at how busy our store is! I love it! And he just looks so cute sitting at his desk while everyone's, like, browsing. And, I mean, he doesn't really need to even, like... Um... Discuss shopping preferences. We don't really even need to try that hard, which is lovely. Ask about price range. We're just going to have simple conversations with the people that seem to be ready to purchase. Discuss shopping preferences. Um, I don't think we have any perks. So, like, I wonder if we can cheat this. Oh, we can. No, we can't. Never mind. I thought I cheated it. It was magic. I think we can. You think we'd be able to. Um. Cheats. Increase points. Retail points. Ooh, that's okay. <laughs> Look, I'm going to cheat because I just want the faster checkout. Um. We won't. Do, I just want the faster checkout. So where is not the small one? We want the big one. That's all I really want. We're not going to restock because we'll. What slick salesman? Greater chance of succeeding. Okay, sure. We don't need to do cheaper restocking or anything. Sure sale. Sure, that sounds great. Why didn't? Oh, that's re serious shopper. Sure. Ooh, we can get additional employees. What's mega manager? Sure, let's get everything. Curious shoppers. We don't need the placard or anything like that. Let's get additional employees. Um, what does this do? Perfect. Is the registered one? We don't really care about that. A stunning sign. We don't need that. Or the pedestal. Uh, we'll get that when we get our first simoleon. That's all we really need. Oh, but we will have probably... I actually want our... I would love to have... Um, uh, Lunette kind of work here. So hopefully we can add her as an employee when we move her out. That'd be great. Compliment. There's a lot of people here. Oh, great. She's ready to check out. Let's come over here and ring her up. Cool. What's she going to buy? Which potion are you buying and how much money are we going to make? If for some reason, could you stop talking and go over and, uh, also this is a good place to meet eligible bachelors or something. Oh, did everybody like just decide they don't want to buy anything and leave? Like, everybody all of a sudden just dropped off. I mean, there's some people leaving, but that's cool. Like, it's fine. People are browsing. But, like, everybody all of a sudden... 
Three hundred bucks. Okay, that's not bad. Why are you? Oh, it's overheating. Okay, hold on a second. Let's get a. Um, I didn't put a thing in here, so let's get a thingy, a jiggy. We don't want retail items. I want electronics. We want one of these. We need one of these. Let's put you. Okay. Okay. Good lord. The game is really janky right now. Okay. Let's just put you there. Because it's summer. We don't want everybody sweating to death. Let's set thermostat to cooler. We've made a whole $300. Oh my god, now my game is really glitchy and terrible. But let's come over here and... Oh, we can sure sail her. Sure, why not? Oh, never mind. Wait, 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 wait. Which dude is... Is it? Oh, it's this guy. This guy? Bring up customer. Wow, I don't know what is going on with my game right now. It's really fucking laggy as shit. Okay, go bring him up. Why is he not doing it go here what the hell is wrong with you bring up customer and then ring up customer like I don't know the game is j janky as fuck maybe we'll just sell these and then we'll end and we'll go back because like it's it's just kind of being really weird um because I went into remove sign Okay, hurry up and get that. Now hurry up and come over here. $13! Okay, we gotta jack up our prices. Uh, Ring up customer. And then we'll close. Although they're close to purchasing, but... uh, Because it's only like $11! We need to jack up our prices, like... Okay, let's remove the sign. Let's remove the sign and then set store prices. Exorbitant markup. Because like $13 for our potion? Dude, that's fucking ridiculous. And why are all three of those gone? She picked, bought something for $300. How the hell did those only sell for 13 I don't know. Anyway, go home. Actually, before you do that, I want you to, um, sim to dating app. Let's look up sim. Let's go see who's available. Let's do a specific date. Um, let's see if there's somebody, oh, we could go on a date with Caleb. Oh, we can go knock up the group. I wonder if we can, though. You used to be able to, and then I feel like they took that out. Um, I just want... Oh, she hates us. Anybody good that we want, like, to have our babies? I mean... Why are you pretending to be Santa Claus? I don't think we should have a baby with Santa Claus. I think that's a little fucking wrong. Um... I'm looking if there's anybody I made or, like, you know, whatever. But, like, I mean, we really shouldn't have kids right now. But I'm just seeing if there's anybody, like, worth it out there. She's kind of cute. But she looks like an elder, doesn't she? Maybe it's just she doesn't have, like, a thing on. I don't know. I mean, I'm not going to lie. There's a lot of old people out there. And Paisley's kind of cute, but like, I mean, do we go for the Grim Reaper and see if we can manage that? Like, see if we can manage to knock up the Grim Reaper? Like, boy, we really, I sent you some money, buy yourself something good with that. Wow. Yeah, you really need to go on a little bit of a jug. You're getting a little thick. Like, what the hell? You really definitely need to, like, exercise <laughs> I feel, I'm so mean to him. But, like, you were so adorable, and you're going to get pudgy before you know it. That was embarrassing. You know why 
You shouldn't be embarrassed. Caleb sent you money because we're taking care of his child, for fuck's sake. I mean, we could always knock up Caleb again. We have two children with an alien, two children with Caleb. We'll have a child with Waldo, and we can have another child with somebody else. We could try to knock up the Grim Reaper, is all I'm saying. Um, I don't, I don't know how well that would work. But if the Grim Reaper is on Simda, but then how would I know if the Grim Reaper is pregnant? Hmm. Also, we should get Grandma to give us some money, is all I'm saying. But she probably wouldn't, because her daughter left her to become a spellcaster and not a vampire. But we have a vampire great-grandchild. All I'm saying. Uh, you know. So, like, a vein shouldn't be pissed. Like, look, we have a oh, vampire child. Maybe she'll send us money. That'd be nice. Um, why don't you... More choices. Go jogging. Go for a little jog. You're angry because you're hungry, but there's food out, so you should go get food. Um, you should be doing this school project. Why don't you come over here and work carefully on this? Who's calling you now? Severa was calling us to say something, but I missed it. Um... And then you can actually come assist with project. That'll be nice. Where are you? You need social and you need hygiene, but you're getting your hygiene and you are eating. So, okay. And then technically, I believe your brother should already... Why in the world is Neville not aging up? Neville should be a fucking, like... Like, he looks like it, but it's like, there's something about it this way, right? He just got a little bit thicker this way. I mean, his ass. You have it all in the ass. I mean, there is nothing wrong with that. You have got the bubbliest booty ever. But it is, like, right? Doesn't he look a little thicker? But he's not, I don't know. Look, I just... Yeah, sure, come on over. Gilderoy is burning to death. Why? Okay, can you... Well, we're going to change that. You're outside exercising. Um, you can have you go home now. I don't want you to die. Oh, look at Grandpa taking care of the baby. Are you, like, here? I thought she was coming over. I don't see her. We said okay. Oh, there she is. Duh. So why don't you come over here and give her the residence keys because she's your sister and you want her to be able to come over back to her house anytime you want. Um, oh, she is like pissed. She doesn't like her nieces, I guess. Like, Well, she only has one niece for now. Thanks for cleaning up, Morgan. Oh, never mind. Thanks for being an asshole, Morgan. I love you, though. Okay, so anyway, he's coming back. You look disgusting. I'll probably just, like, cheat him a little trimmer and cast when we change our babies. Just because! I know it's rude, but, like... Anyway, um... Okay, are you gonna... You really need to go take a bath. And then go grab something to eat. You're doing your pro... Weren't you supposed to be assisting your granddaughter with her project Morgan I mean he went and took care of the baby so I can't really blame him so Morgan's like look what the fuck um we have it set to cooler okay but like everybody's in there could you go take a fucking bath go take a fucking bath what the actual hell god everyone in this house is being a raging fucking asshole why don't you come assist too um, or you could... Oh, never mind. I was like, oh, you could go play with Regulus, but he's over there. There you go. Okay, so... Oh, good, she came back. Yeah, all right. Anyway. Well, we're going to age the kid up before we... But I definitely just wanted... Oh, he's remembering the birth of his child. That was embarrassing from Caleb sending him money. Um, I just don't know who else for him to have babies with. Like, who else can we throw in this game? I I do think we should have a child. I think we should try to knock up the Grim Reaper. I think it'll be amazing. Um, if we can. I don't know if you can anymore. You used to be able to. 
Also, I'm not really sure where that baby would end up. Hmm. Anyway, did you give her a key? Uh, I think she left. Oh, wait, you know what? When you're done, why don't you actually... Did you give her? No, okay, you did. Good. I just missed it, but... I love this outfit. God, I love you so much. Little Morgan Jr. <laughs> like... <laughs> Honestly, he did what most of the female sims do. They just kind of fill out down here, like in the hips. Which is just... Yay! Good for you, Myrtle! Alright, now you need to go pee. We can put this outside. So it's like outside our front house, so I don't know. Um... I don't know where else to put it. We don't really have a place for it. We can just... We'll just put it outside our front door. For now. Or... Ooh, we could. They're all out there chatting. Let's put it... Ooh, that's all of our potions. Let's put it in there. And then we can activate it. Let's see what it does. Because I don't know. I don't know if I've ever... Let's go activate that. Oh, I guess you don't have to do anything. It just automatically does it if you turn activate on. Oh. Cute! Is this poor quality? Yeah, maybe we should uh, deactivate it because it's probably going to burn the house down. Um. <laughs> okay, you should go to sleep because you're tired. You are also tired, so you should go to sleep. You go sleep. You go need to go get something to eat. And then probably go to sleep. Where are you? You're out here chatting with your you're sister. That's cute. Um, you're fine. All right. It's almost Myrtle's birthday. Yeah, well. Why was he waving to someone? He's like, bye. Oh, okay. Because she was leaving. All right. So you're going to eat. And then when you are done eating, you can go to bed. You're going to go check your nephew. You can go pee. Um, where are you going? Oh, you could have just put that down where you were. Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay. All right, could you... Are you going to go tuck him in? Is that what you were going to do, tuck in your nephew? Okay. Could you... Could you just go to bed? She's going to go, it's his birthday. Yeah, I know, but, um, wait a minute. Everybody ages up today. Oh, dear God. Ah, uh, yeah, wow. Well, that kind of sucks because, well, that means Alora's going to move out. Not Alora. Lunette's going to move out. Um, Myrtle's going to age up and we'll have to give her a makeover in the next part because unless we have her age up, first so we can just give her and um Galileo makeovers how did he not how is Max not aged up he should be older than Galileo he should have automatically aged up so this is weird um I don't know but we could Okay, could you stop and go the fuck to sleep? I've been trying to tell you to go to bed for, like, fucking four days. You can come in here and... Bottle feed the baby. Rock the baby. Make a silly face. Take care of your grandson. And then change his diaper. Who the fuck now? Okay, well... I have a feeling we're having our next alien baby because... Gilderoy can't stop getting pregnant every time he gets abducted. So, well, um... You're only allowed to have six kids, Gilderoy, so I'm gonna need you to stop. This house is gonna be way too full, but... Elora will move out in the next part. I wanted Neville to age up first, but... I mean... Well, we'll just let Galileo age up when he ages up. We do... I think I will... 
wait a few minutes. I know we're at 40 minutes, but you know these have been getting closer to like 45. Um, but I do want Myrtle to age up. Uh, she's technically not... It is her birthday. It's zero. To, she's not... Her bar's not glowing, but today is her birthday. I do want to age her up. Um... Do you have cooking skill? Does anybody in this house have cooking skill? Not really. What's your cooking skill? Well, you're better at cooking, so you could serve breakfast. Let's serve scrambled eggs with bacon. Um, I'm also going to take out our cake. Because she should age up the baby. Okay, can you... Are you taking care of the baby? Yes, you are, because you're the greatest grandpa ever. All right, so you're eating a burger. You just decided to not cook. Oh, did you just go throw up? Oh, no, you decided to... You threw up, didn't you? You're fucking alien pregnant, aren't you? Oh, he's fucking alien pregnant, isn't he? I mean, I'm just guessing if you came into the bathroom and didn't do what I told you. Um, magic. Spells. No. Why do you not... Do you know Scrubberoo? You should just do that. Change dirty diaper. Oh, not you. You. Get in here and change dirty diaper. And then you can go pee. But not in the bathroom we're going to, uh... Hold on. Stop cleaning. Go... Not stop. Stop cooking. Go clean the toilet, because I want somebody to use magic. This is amazing. You are fucking alien pregnant. I know you are, because... And now, resume scrambled eggs. Because Morgan was going to go pee, and I didn't want him peeing in a dirty toilet. And you are going to go take a bath, and then you can come down here and blow out the candles. It's a little bit early for your birthday, but then you won't have to go to school today, which will be nice. You'll have a day off of school. So there you go. All right, good. So why don't you, when you're done, come here and blow out the candles? Because then we'll have lots of, uh, this kid is disgusting, so you need to, can we magic him? Why can't I magic my child? Hmm. Oh. All right. So. Oh, God, that's true. She's a teenager now. Oh, my God. We have a teenage daughter. Oh, my God. Parenting. No. I need toddler care. Uh, Give him a bath. Okay. Before anybody takes a piece, can you add birthday candles to that? Um. Okay. So Myrtle is a teenager. Elora will also age up, but I'm going to wait and age her up. We'll, we'll leave this out because we're going to need it. Um, Elora is going to age up today too, but I'm going to have her age up. And the baby is supposed to age up. But yeah, I just, it's really fucking weird that you have not. Okay, fine. Max finally aged up. Good. So Neville aged up. Um... Myrtle aged up, and now we are going to age up. Yeah, the baby. This baby. Galileo. So, we will have Myrtle, Neville, and Galileo's makeover for the next part. And then we will also have Morgan's birthday and Alora's birthday in the next part. But they don't need makeovers because they're fine. Like, Morgan will be an elder. Elora will be a young adult. We'll move her out at the end of the next part. Um, but yeah, so are you going to come? What are you doing? Oh, you're bathing him. I forgot about that. Right. So you come, finish bathing the child. Okay. Now you come downstairs and age him up. And um, we'll just really hope that you are. You don't. S Maybe you're not alien pregnant. I hope you're not. Okay, good. So, how did Galileo and Neville age up with the exact same fucking hair and the same out? Oh my god, guys, they have the same hair and they have the same fucking shirt but reverse colors. His was 
green and orange, and his is orange and green. That is some fucking weird shit. I'm gonna go to Manage Worlds, and I'm gonna- Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six. He'll count as seven. Okay. Wait, it's fine. I can have up to ten sims in my house. Plus, we're gonna move Alora out, but... We'll have six in our house when we're- After we move her out, we have seven now. So, I just... Eh. I mean, we still have pet stuff around. We should get them a fucking pet or something. But, oh, my God. Okay, hold on a second. Manage households. Let's go to... Okay. Transfer sims between households. Um, I'm not even kidding. Fucking look at this bullshit. He is... They're, <laughs> they're like fucking twins of each other. How is that even possible? They are like 100% clones. I know they have the same dad, technically, Gilderoy, but their other parent is different. Although, if you look at it, like, he really does look a lot like Morgan. It's so weird. I think he looks more like Caleb, I'm guessing, because he doesn't, he doesn't look like either one of his... <laughs> Anyway, um, oh, I didn't end up, I didn't actually, fuck, I didn't actually transfer, I didn't click OK. Um, so there we go, yes. All right, so now I'll make over everybody, we'll take you out. Everyone will get makeovers, we'll see what the toddlers look like and what Myrtle looks like as a teenager. So anyway, I'm going to wrap this part up here, I will see you guys next time. Remember to give the video a big thumbs up and subscribe to see more.